I am not interested, Lucretia. I'm not interested. But you didn't even examine this. Drapers have a disciplinary, you know. Disciplinary, Mr. Draper. Yes. That's something, Lucretia. I am not a Arrest, Mm. Calm down, Drapers. Oh, yeah. Don't let your blood yeah. start conglomerating. <laughs> if you don't put back that discipline, time, my drapey. Yes. Yeah. Ah, war. Oh yes. Man, you yeah. handle them, woman, man. If you were not so <laughs> well countrified, you would appreciate my knowledge of know architecture. That we don't want to have a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little is who it is? Who? The king of this one, Worse than that, Miss Scouch. Wrong address, not scouch, not in the air. Dad, all right. Just a minute. Excuse me. Don't move, Miss Bob. Hold it right there until I come. Mrs. Sure. <laughs> um, excuse me, sir. Mas Oliver said to tell you that him is disposable, but needs to take a you. Tell him that I'm from Star Time Productions, and he's been casted in a role. I miss Miss Oliver. <laughs> Needed no man. Yes, no, sir. Look, put on your clothes, right? Because we have to go somewhere. Ah, no. just a minute, sir. We're going inside. Because I don't want grudgeful people. <laughs> oh no, I'm not this place. Oh, sorry. Nice this news, this is me here, yeah, you know. <laughs> okay, no. Um, just a minute. First things first. What is your name? Frederick Anthony Robert Tibble. <laughs> what you can call me, Festus. All right, now put on your clothes. <laughs> Is where we going? We're going to rehearse. Rehearse for what? Why oh, you ask so much question? Put on your clothes. I want to know where we're going. You know, interrogate people. Get dressed. But I'm not moving one inch until I know where I'm going and why. We are going to rehearse. Rehearse for what? We're going into flims. <laughs> flims? <laughs> like movies? Yes, man. Hurry up. Time is money. Tell me more. We're going to be movie stars. I don't believe it. <laughs> you remember Dasa? Yes, I remember Dasa. How could I forget Dasa? Dasa, not the big foot muscular woman who used to drive the back of Mr. Brown. <laughs> you remember Dasa? <laughs> the first time they introduced her to me, you see, mm. and she shake my hand. I nearly wet up myself. I look up. Did he drink me? Did have in my hand? <laughs> well, she work at an advertising agency downtown. Me know. Me not see her drive past my dear in our heavy duty equipment mm -hmm. shop. <laughs> <laughs> well, I she send it to you. Oh. So you is not no talent scout. I know your face, you know. You is a messenger. Uh, yes. Huh? You must do this ad. And they want two male actors. So she recommend you and me. Ad? What me think you did say it was a movies? How much part you think you did? Hollywood? You just come excited of people so with your foolishness about movies, do I? And it's only like a television commercial. Only a television commercial? You have one like you did by the pan TV. Of course, me come pan TV. One time, one minivan did crash down a four show road <laughs> and me go look, and television camera come down there and take me and me see myself from the news. Why oh. you think them the actor they get them big break? On TV? On TV! Anyway, I don't think say that the commercial is very important if them allow for them truck driver for recommend weed. Oh, you chat so? Come on, no man. So, we have to go to audition. Audition? For what? So that them can test if we see if we have talent. You don't seem to understand. We get the part already. That sounds funny to me. That's arranged everything. All we need to do is to rehearse. Well, Anna, so me know it go. How you chat, so? Because me know what me talking about. To get a particular role. Them have to know your psychological and physiological characteristics. 
Uh, uh, I like Stephen Springboard. I will tell that as he said, tongues, but no tongues. Uh, wait, hold on, wait, wait. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. It's not so that me don't like the part and me don't want it, you know. It's just that it just feels strange to me. You want the role or you don't want the role? What is the role? What do you mean? What part I play in? What is my character? Who you think you is? Al Pacino? No. <laughs> Let me see. I know what I'm doing, you know. I know about these things. And if you come to my... Let me tell you something, you see, first. Look, man, you see, what matter is the part you're playing, you understand? And the kind of opportunities that are going to open up for me. Look. Can you imagine the walk going to the place? Are you going to give your Grammy Award performance? Academy. Oh, jeez, oh, man. Imagine the kind of opportunities we are going to get. Well, you could have a pint there. This advertisement is for what? Me no know. Me no business. Just come back. We go rehearse. <laughs> Tell me something. Where is the rehearsal? I'm in yard. <laughs> your yard. <laughs> Hold on. So your yard turn TV studio now. <laughs> no man, not like that. It's just a place where we go and we cannot sketch we look at practice. So how are we going to practice and we don't know what part we play? You know, okay. remember when we used to learn for drive? Don't you used to go stay the young car park? You couldn't go anywhere else? No. But after you get your license, no. Don't you could have driven anyway? Yes. Then not the same situation may I try to show you. The minute you get in your local practice, you can't hack anyway. You know, when I was at school, I hack in a player. The cow jump over the moon. <laughs> yes, yes. I was the cow. <laughs> I can't bet how you fit the part. Anyway, put on your clothes. Time ago. Aye. Festus, tell me something, you see. This commercial, uh, it pay well? Every ticket you have to ask about money, you can't even think about the potential career this could have for you. How much money may get in? Six hundred dollars. That no sound bad. <laughs> it are Come on, come on, time ago. Put on your clothes, man. Move it, move it, move it, man. Aye. Is what I have in another bag there? Literatures, written material. For what? For rehearse with, plays and things. You have the cow jump over the moon? <laughs> no, man. <laughs> May have a midsummer night's nice dream, Hamlet, and the miser. What doers? Literature, classics written by the masters, like Shakespeare and Maliri, uh, and them people. Eh? Malaria. <laughs> that sounds like one of them diseases where mosquitoes are hard. You know, say malaria. You say malaria. Listen to this. I know a bank where the wild thyme blows, where the ox lips and nodding violets grows. Ox lips? <laughs> From pipe cock to pipe rooster. From cow's lips to ox lips. <laughs> Ox lips is a flower. Hey, you read something out there. Read that. Let me hear you song. What thou seest when thou awakest, <laughs> take it for thy true love's sake. Look here now, Festus. You not got nothing right in our English. Then this not English, Shakespeare English. Well, I uh, go up the role we playing is in Jamaican English. <laughs> Look, man, you have to versatile if you want to make it big. I can have any language. Come on, time ago. Let's go. All right. What thou seest <laughs> when thou best awakest <laughs> is not meest. <laughs> Is everything ready? Pinock, is everybody ready? Just a minute.
Just a minute. Listen to me. This shebang is costing me $10,000 an hour. That is $166.66 per minute. I don't have a minute. I cannot afford a minute. That's it. These lights are just Is everything ready? One minute. Another minute, that's $166.66. Wanna go and have me bankrupt? <laughs> Listen to me. You adjusted the, the color on these cameras. Everything all right, sir. Good, good. Brenda, where is Brenda? Where is Brenda with all the props, man? Just leave them from yesterday. All right, good, good. Now let's have your attention, please, everybody. Attention. Quiet! I said quiet, please. Oxman. Good. Now, I just want to tell you that this is basically a very simple, everyday, 30 second dog food commercial. Makeup? Come in. <laughs> Thank you, my love. Monica, take some still photographs of the set or something. Don't just stand there, please, please. All right, as I was saying, this is a simple, everyday, 30 second dog food commercial. So let's keep it that way. Simple. Good. Now, where are the dogs? <laughs> I said, where are the stupid dogs? Are you a matter? No, I don't understand what I said. You know, I'm telling you to you. It's all right, man. Just cooperate. After this, you'll be $600 extra. Butch! Are you there? No, Sam, it's you. Butch is the bulldog. That's you. And Mitch is the mongrel. That's you. Now, Butch. Yes, sir. Don't forget that you are the bulldog. Yes, sir. You ever hear a, a, a dog say, you yes, sir? Yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Get into character, man. Say, bow. All right, Mitch. Are you fidgeting? In the machine of dog flea. Mm. Now, Butch, listen. You are the top dog. You are the star. <laughs> now, the plot is very, very, very simple. You, Butch, are in front of your kennel eating the inferior dog food. When Mitch, Mitch, come over here. You enter over here and you bully Butch and take away his food. All right? Now, the next day, Butch is eating blow our dog food. And Mitch comes in again, he tries to bully Butch, but Butch is not having any of this, and he beats up Mitch, and Mitch runs off with his tail between his legs. All right? Good. Let's go, everybody. <laughs> All right, sir. Um, excuse me. May I make a suggestion? What, Mitch? I don't like the part where Butch beat up Mitch. And I think... Think Mitch is a good plot. I like it. Mitch. We are not paying you a thousand dollars each to think. We're paying you to be dogs. A thousand dollars each? It's all right, man. Forget it. Forget it. Come here, Miss Tamich. I have to talk to you. No, this is... Are there any more questions? Yes, sir. I have a question. Yes, Butch. We have any lines in the script? Lines? Yeah. You stupidy. What kind of line dog you have? I'm not talking to you. I will deal with you later. Now, excuse me, Mr. Manager. Director. Oh, yes, excuse me, Mr. Director. Mm. But um, we're going to get some time for rehearsals, huh? Uh, Butch would like to have some rehearsals at $166.66 a minute. Hey, Chucky, why not a few for rehearsals? Shut your mouth. I'm not talking to you, mongrel. It's all right, young yeah, Mr. Director. We're going to go right tonight for you. All right, positions, please, everybody. Now, this is a walkthrough, but the camera will be running. All right, so good. Positions. Where me must go? You'll be down here by the kennel, and you'll be eating the dough. Cecil, where is the inferior dog food, man? Here, here, here. All right, good. Now, Butch, you're going to be eating this inferior dog food. Oh, Patrick, I hate this script. This script is terrible, man! All right, come, positions. Down on all fours, Butch. You ever see a dog pan two foot yet? Under you. Don't much. All right. Now, eat dog food. Ignore the cameras. Just eat up. Go. No, man. I, I, need, to, I need to hear sounds. Sounds? After me not getting a script. What kind of sound you want? 
slurping sounds, man. You know how dogs sound when they eat. After me never dine with no dog yet. <laughs> concentrate, concentrate. Come, let's go. Perfect now. All right, concentrate, concentrate. Bring a big man like me to come, 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 star as dog. You will get this done. Try again, Butch. Come, try again. Keep in character, keep in character. That's it, keep in character, keep in character. <laughs> you look like Lassie. You're going to see, I'm going to see you. Please, 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 please. At $166.66, please try and concentrate. Well, turn up my hands and stop, and I'm here, yes, sir. Behave yourself, please. What's wrong with you, man? You can't have. What did you come down here for? All right, listen, we're going to go for a take. This is Blow Wow Dog Food Commercial. Take one and action. <laughs> Cut! Oh. These amateurs! Mitch, <laughs> listen to me. You're coming up to another dog in a threatening manner. The commercial does not call for a macho dog, it calls for an aggressive dog. Holy oh, idiot. <laughs> macho dog. <laughs> not you, Lassie. Me a pettigree, me no mongrel. Aggressive. Okay? Now let's do it again. Positions, please. Blow wall, dog food commercial. Two, take one, two, and action. <laughs> what no? Butch, you man. You are eating your dog food, and another dog comes up to you in a threatening manner. What would you do? I don't know, you know, sir, because it's the first time I'm going to eat dog food. It's not something that I do regular. Bro, snarl. Get him to the wall, man. Growl. You saw me up in a sand But after you now do better. <laughs> Please. Just the two of you. Will you just growl and snarl? What? And action. Monkey, monkey. Uh, yeah. Why? 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 
Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? Why? And a two thousand dollar again. Why? Your teeth in wretch. No, no, no. I will not try to do it. 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 something you see man ever since the commercial started to show up on tv <laughs> i can't walk in peace on the street you know <laughs> if me no man shop they mob me <laughs> that's the life of a celebrity me i tell you that commercial is a real favorite you know a big hit me really have to say thanks to you all the same because uh, from me born is the first time anybody ever did anything for me so how come nobody now see me? How come nobody now mob me? And I did two hours with it in there. It's so the movie work on massa. I am the star. You is just a little supporting dog. Did I daddy dead? Oh, how the place so neat and clean. I am expecting company. <laughs> so what the letter you for? Well, some of those is from my fans, and some is from people who want me to do commercial for them. The two are we? No, just <laughs> me. <laughs> is there any offers you like? Uh-uh, not really. I'm not particularly interested in none of them. I'm waiting for the right opportunity. Dear Mr. Adams, we would like you to endorse a flea powder for dogs. <laughs> that is a good one. Would you be interested in playing a minor role as a security dog for a documentary? <laughs> oh, oh, uh. We would like you to endorse a deworming tablet for dogs. <laughs> this is not your concern. You're too inquisitive. What a so dog offer you get? So far, 
But there's much more to come. Well, me glad say me never impress nobody. Because Muda never go back in on one of the dark commercial again. Me oh. <laughs> 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 wait for my ride full time. This is just a start. <laughs> Oliver the star, dog. This is the biggest thing since Lassie. <laughs> Laugh all you want, man. Laugh all you want. But what you do know is that this commercial open up a whole heap of opportunities for me. Oh, yeah? Like what? You remember Mrs. Jones, the lady that live up the hill? The one with the two bends? Right. And the daughter with the enter Miss Jamaica? That's correct. <laughs> Well, she come down here, come check me yesterday. What? Come off of the hill, come down yesterday and I get her to you? It did shock me too. <laughs> so what she want? Well, you know, she said, a family member see the commercial pan TV mm. and falls suddenly in love with me and is dying to meet me. You lie! Dead serious. And she bringing her down here today. I wonder is who? Common sense, Festus. Common sense. How much of them live up there? A three of them. The husband, the wife, and the daughter, Sophie. Well, it's not the wife because if she come down here, come tell me. And it just couldn't be the husband. <laughs> Sophie. Well, you're bright. Oliver, you're gone. Clear me, boy. What a nice piece of girl. <laughs> <laughs> nice, you see. The girl's sweet, not a wet sugar. <laughs> tell your man. Yeah. Is that Kiara? Yes. What happens? He's them. You see her? Mrs. Jones, come out of the car. She alone? No, wait. A two of them. A she? What she wearing? A fur coat. Pestos. You think we look formal enough? Yes, man. <laughs> but I know Sophie. I know Sophie. I know Sophie. No. No. Then it's who? <laughs> what? Hell ever do about my dog? <laughs> <laughs> 